All right, welcome to ITS Tactical's Knot of the Week. Today we're going to be doing a round lashing, and the start of a round lashing is going to be done with a clove hitch. So you're going to take one of your posts here, start a clove hitch. Um, I'm not going to go into this in too much detail. If you need help doing a clove hitch, please refer to our previous Knot of the Week series. So once you have your clove hitch, you're going to take the working end. This essentially becomes the working end of your clove hitch, and you're going to marry up your pole here next to it and you're gonna make let's see I'm gonna go down with my turns so you're gonna make about eight different turns around this and these don't need to be super tight but they need to be kinda tight because what you want to do is when you do your frapping turns in the middle you want to be able to still twist these so let's see we got six and we got eight so now what you're going to do is you're going to go inside the two posts with that last wrap of your working end here. And we're going to make two frapping turns around the middle. So one, two. And then on the bottom leg of this frapping turn, you're going to come back up through the middle again, just like so. And you're going to tie another clove hitch down here. Or you can go to the opposite side. I'll actually go ahead and do the opposite side just to balance everything out here. Your clove hitch, you can twist the poles a little bit to get that last clove hitch. Once you have the last clove hitch completed here, you should be able to twist these open and that is your round lashing, just like so. Thanks for watching, and this has been an ITS Tactical Knot of the Week on a round lashing. If you have any questions, be sure to post them in the comments and let us know. Thanks for watching.